have any social interaction. I actually ordered an eyeliner and another mascara from Mass Style, so that's what I was expecting this package to be.
の住まいだと思うんですがはあ亡命した役人のことなんか知らないんだ双子の兄弟を引き取ったはずなんです知らないってどうだおお思い出した個人から引き取ったあの双子そうだ511キンダーハイブやっと君はいい建物が取り壊されて。
Sometimes I get the question on how I know which order to put which shipping label on once it's in the envelope. I write the order number on the outside of the envelope and then I cover it with the shipping label. I'm gonna go to Costco on the way back from dropping off all of these orders that I need to bring to the post office.
It's been quite a while since I've done a chatty sit down segment, but I guess in general I don't <laughs> I don't even talk on camera that much. I don't know, I've been in a more chatty mood and I feel like I want to get closer to you guys. I think I express myself best through writing and talking even not to a camera. Sometimes it makes me hyper aware of what I'm saying or I feel like I come off awkward and not always say exactly what I mean to. But I've had the desire lately to start talking more in my vlogs and with the year being nearly half over, um, I thought I'd ask for some questions on Instagram for a little mini chit chat Q&A, catch up with me, life update. So a lot of y'all asked just how am I doing? How are you doing, Annika? I'm pretty exhausted from it all. I think I was more exhausted last week, which I feel like you could tell from my vlog. All I do was packing pretty much all day. I, I'm in disbelief how, how many people order for my shop. It's weird to think that this many people I'm actually giving physical things to as well. I'm so I'm so extremely grateful. But it does take a lot of work, so as well as balancing YouTube because editing, I I don't show you guys when I am editing, but basically anytime I'm not vlogging, I'm either packing orders or editing. <laughs> Mentally, I'm doing all right. Been better obviously when I'm getting more sleep, but it's nothing to be worried about or concerned about at all. How has it been living alone for nearly half a year? It doesn't feel like it's been half a year, honestly. As I mentioned before in my previous q and I think my last living situation when I had a roommate, I was doing things pretty independently. Moving to my own place now didn't feel like that big of a jump. But these days, I am feeling a bit of the loneliness. I don't think it's loneliness due to living alone necessarily. I think it's more socially because my job is working from home and by myself, I pretty much don't have any social interaction unless I intentionally plan things to go out with friends to see people. But these days when I'm super busy, I don't really have that much time to go out and see friends. Some days I will just go the entire day without speaking. I think that's partly why I have had the desire to start speaking more in vlogs because this might be my only source of human connection for the day. My really close friend has left LA and a lot of my friends have graduated this year. Everyone's kind of off doing their own thing now. I have been finding myself missing a little bit of it. I think talking like this though, it's pushing me out of my comfort zone. I'm trying to make friends now in the big adult world, which is a little weird and difficult to navigate. But I have been pushing myself out of my comfort zone and meeting up more with people who I met in LA who live here, who I'm slowly opening up to and becoming closer friends with. How's your apartment feeling now that it's becoming your own space? <gasps> oh, I love this question. Decorating and apartment decor makes me so happy. The crazy thing is, I feel like I've barely started. I'm excited to start working on my balcony. I think that's gonna be my next project. I really want to Make an actual like vegetable garden if I can. I have to do some research. I don't know anything about plants, growing food, but literally all that's on my balcony is the one tomato plant. Cherry's getting a little lonely, so I want to plant some friends for her. And I didn't even, oh, I didn't even think about my bedroom yet. Your girl is determined to get her mattress off the floor this year. Upcoming bedroom makeover. I enjoy being cozy and down on the floor, you know, I know what place but I think it's, I think we're time for an upgrade. Any plans for the future and can you talk more about your Japan trip? So I'll probably talk more about my Japan trip as it comes closer to that time. I have been working on a big group trip to Japan next year in August. I am going to meet some of you guys who watch my videos and we are going to go on a food tour of three cities, Tokyo, Kyoto, and Osaka. And we're going to take some cooking classes, see the sights, meet each other, and connect. There are still some tickets available as well, so I will leave the link to that in the description below in case you want to check it out. There's still over a year until that happens, so that's why I haven't been talking about it too much. But there are limited spots, so if you think that's something you'd be interested in, I'd love to meet you. As for more immediate plans, for the second half of this year, I'm definitely going to be continuing to focus and work on my shop. I have so many more products that I want to make and manufacture, not just stickers and stationery, but... No, 
I'll keep it a surprise. <laughs> but know that there's a lot in the works. I don't really know. I feel like I don't have too much planned. Just living my life, taking each week as it comes. I do kind of like doing these chatty segments though. It does feel like I'm having a meal with my close friend. And I know there's topics that a lot of you would like for me to talk more about. I asked about it on my Instagram and a lot of you want to hear more about living alone and my experience, as well as a ton of questions I always get about my business, which I plan on doing maybe once it's been at least a year since I started running it because I am a newbie. I'm not qualified to give you any advice. I'm figuring everything out as I go every day. Google is my best friend. A business Q&A, if you will, will probably be far in the future. Let's try these out. Thank you. 